about going to the washroom and <laughs> he was talking about how he doesn't understand how I do number one and number two really quickly and I told him that it's because I just don't mess around in the washroom like I don't look at my phone I don't read a magazine if people do that anymore I don't fiddle with my fingers like you know I don't know I just go in take a lap <laughs> walk out. Okay, it's not the much of pooing so quickly. It's the how she pees so fast, faster than a dude. Okay, so we'd be going on a date, right? Say we go to the movies, and then uh, at the end, I'm like, "Hey, babe, I gotta go pee." And you're like, "Me too." So we go exactly at the same time, but she's out before me, and I'm like, "Wait, how did that happen?" I zip pee, zip up, wash my hands, come out, and I'm just like, "What did you do to pee faster than me?" Like, I'm like... You drink a lot of water. Yeah. In all fairness, he drinks a lot of water all the time. I'm talking like five to six liters a day. Well, so than, your peas... Okay, more than that. So your peas must also reflect that amount. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, but it's just... You, like, I don't... Because your, your no. actions to pee, right, are, you know, zip, pants... I, what do we zip? I wear yoga pants. Oh, okay, I'm just saying... So like, it's just a pull down. So you pull down, you pee... And then wipe, wipe, and then you get back up, and pull then you pull up, up. and wash my hands. Yeah, and then you walk. walk like out I said, I don't mess around. Good morning, Kai. Good morning, Kai. <gasps> Who's that? Morning. Morning. McDonald. <laughs> Thank you. Hello. So it seems like everyone is feeling a little under the weather. So, including Kai. So today I made a radish and carrot soup with some ginger and vegetable stock and some seaweed. And I'm gonna take the soup, add it to Kai's cereal. I'm going to mush up the, the carrots and radish and I'll give him some grape as a dessert so you guys will get to see him eat salads. This is his meal. Three grapes sliced up real small. We got the rice mixed in with the soup broth, and then we got the carrots and daikon there. All right, babe. You can play with your food. Mm. He has teeth now, so he's able to chew some of his food, but it still needs to be pretty, pretty soft. Right? And we're trying to give Kai the opportunity to explore his food a little. So, he has an extra utensil here that he can definitely use to play with. And he can see that I'm playing with this one, playing. And he will, and he will understand that there's certain foods that you can eat with your hands and he has to put it to his mouth. And there's a couple of times where he'll grab the utensil and bring it to his mouth. So that's the type of thing that we want at nine and a half months. So, right baby. Good morning, everybody. I don't even know what day it is anymore. My work does not help me whatsoever on that front. But I came home last night sick as a dog. I just think Kai's a little sick, so he probably got me sick too. Great way to start off the year. Currently, I am going to be trying out this new treatment uh, from this place called Ice 21. So it's like this cryo freezing fat freeze treatment. It's not cool sculpting apparently. I honestly don't know the difference. I guess I'll see when I get there. I'll try to film as much as I can. Usually like these places don't like to be filmed unless you're like, you know, somebody and I'm not somebody, I'm just me. <laughs> 
So today I'm freezing this. I'm freezing this fucking double chin, okay? Because the next few weeks, it's going to be just straight treatments. Like I'm talking like hair treatment, lip treatment, teeth treatment, now body treatment. Um, I'm just getting like prepped for the wedding, you know? So almost every week up until the wedding, I have something to do in terms of prepping. So you guys are going to see a lot of like background stuff for planning this wedding. It's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, I just hope that I start to feel better sooner rather than later. done my treatment I see very minimal difference but I do feel a lot smoother currently waiting in the parking lot oh, excuse me I'm so tired nowadays um I'm currently waiting in the parking lot for my lip injection appointment if I look the same as yesterday it's because I'm wearing exactly the same thing to be honest I'm so tired that like I will grab whatever clothes are close by put on my body for like the one hour I'm out in public then go home get into my sweats and I'm in bed like when I'm sick in combination of lack of sleep like this a different joke comes out like I don't know more of a lazier Joanna and these I only get two days off a week right so oh my god um I try my best to like get as much as I can done within those two days but it's even harder to do that when I'm sick, right? So, I don't know if I necessarily feel better, oh, better or worse than yesterday, but actually, you know what? I think I feel worse. I think I feel worse, for sure. Just lack of sleep. Kai is teething and he has four teeth coming in at the same time. He's waking up every freaking 40 to 40 minutes to one hour I need my rest like I'm dying but okay so this is the next day I don't know if I'm swollen just because I'm sick or whatever but to be honest I didn't really see much of a difference with the EMS and um, the cool sculpting whatever you want to call it I know it's one of those things where you like continuously do it like over time and it'll get better but the thing is is that they always tell you to follow this up with more water better diet better exercise now to me in my head call me crazy but good diet great exercise a lot of water results in just a healthier person in general fitter person in general and you'll naturally lose weight if you're doing these things now i don't know if in combination with the cool sculpting is it really the cool sculpting that's helping you or is it just because more of a placebo effect like hey i have this on top of this so now i'm just going to keep with this regimen so then i can see more and better results with the cool sculpting to me i think it's a crock of bullshit after doing what i just did the other day i was like i sat here and did nothing and yet you're still telling me to you know be good with my diet be good with blah 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 Honestly, I think it's just, I think it's bull. <laughs>
feeling much better i still have sinusitis so inflamed sinuses nice there is damien looking after his little brother oh, oh no. so i am currently putting the labels onto one of our pieces for the party favors for the wedding because the wedding is currently about six weeks away Oop. and i really need to finish these so i have 150 of them to go and that is what i'm doing here tedious work i know oh hey not me <laughs> Guys, coming for you guys. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Oh, no, he's gonna get the camera. Oh, oh no, he's coming for you guys. Trying to get like nice filler footage in here. He's trying to get the camp. I am still not 100%, but I am going to go back to work. So I usually work evenings. Actually, the timing has gotten a little bit better. I used to work from like 5 p.m. to 5 a.m., that type of situation. But now I'm actually working from about 5 p.m. to 2.30 a.m. So it's gotten a little bit better. Um, like I said, I'm not feeling 100%, but work is work. Gotta do what I gotta do to get that money. <gasps> We're gonna eat some Japanese barbecue today. Yeah? yeah. Gotta do a fit check. Jordan and I are currently in Vaughn. Today, I didn't really film too much just because it was kind of hectic, but we had to go downtown Toronto to City Hall to pick up our marriage license. Jordan's over here, pumping gas. And we are in Vaughn because we didn't get a chance to celebrate our second engagement anniversary back in December. So we're gonna celebrate now and we're gonna show you where we're going because this place is special to us. It tastes so delicious. Enjoy the clips.
Can you say wow? Wow. Wow. This is the cinematic mode. I thought of giving it a shot on Kai. Hi, Kai. You say hi. Nice. You say mama. 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 Oh. Yay. <laughs> Thank you, mama. Mama. Yeah, mama. Mama. Can you say Kai? Kai? Mama. <laughs> hey babe. It's our Valentine's Day dinner. And we're at Pearl Chinese Cuisine at Baby Village and we are trying out uh, this TikTok trending restaurant. So this is the, what is it? Cream of corn and chicken soup. He ordered the same thing. More to come. Our main course is the Peking duck with homemade pancake. Put a little bit of this. Let's put some uh, cucumber. Cucumber. Nice. Oh no. King sauce. Pretty much all it. You can put other stuff too, but it's all you need. Long apple tea. <laughs> So we'll give her a little bit of sparkle just to open up her eyes a bit. But other than that, that's all she needs. Thank you, Chen. Yep. Hehehe <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>